If you're asked to figure out which one of these fractions is greater, 7 eighths or 7 ninths, here's how you do it. So you could just take and divide 7 by 8 on a calculator, get a decimal, divide 7 by 9 on a calculator, get a decimal, and that would tell you if 7 eighths was greater than, less than, or equal to 7 ninths. And you might just be able to look at it and tell as well. But let's find a common denominator. We have 8 and 9. If we had the same denominator, we could just compare the numerators and we'd be done. So I'm just going to multiply 8 times 9. That would give me 72. Down here, I'll multiply 9 times 8. That also gives me 72. Same denominator. But I can't just multiply the denominator by 8 here. I need to multiply the numerator by 8 as well because 8 over 8 is 1. So I multiply by 1. Don't change the value, just the way it's represented. 7 times 8, that's 56. 56 is an equivalent fraction to 7 ninths. They have the same value. Up here, multiply by 9, and we get 63. This is also an equivalent fraction here now to 7 eighths. And since we have the same denominator, we can compare the numerators. 63 is bigger than 56, so 63 70 seconds. That's bigger than 56 70 seconds by 7 70 seconds. Because these are equivalent, that means 7 eighths. That's going to be larger than 7 ninths. That's it. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.